This is the guy, this is the guy who snuck into the Bohemian Grove and things got crazy. As you just said, he's literally just said right there, dude, we are cooked. So this is the evil people who are running the world and all of, just weird. I'm going to let him do the explanation, but Alex Jones once done this as well. This very thing, same thing that you're about to see, but it's about to get deep. Moloch is the child sacrifice god-ish thing. I... Guys, it's about to genuinely, 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 genuinely get crazy. So sit back Grove. and um, let's let's that's, get this. That's me sneaking inside Bohemian Grove. Yeah, I'm stuck. I gotta run. An invite-only secret society of American elites who gather in the woods two weeks out of every year to decide the future of the world and conduct human sacrifice rituals in front of a 40-foot owl god named Moloch. Or so the rumors say. Many have begun wondering what actually goes down here after famous boxer Ryan Garcia said this. The babies, babies, guys, babies. They're eating babies, literally. And I'm the crazy one. So they're in with these bankers and former presidents yes. and lawyers. And some guy brings over something that it's an effigy that's supposed to be a body. Yeah. And they drop it on the fire and they're all worshiping an owl god. But before you I can't sneak make this into up. the grove, what do the locals nearby know? Right in front of me, we got the hoot owl. You guys know what that owl is? Uh, well, yeah, that's, that's, no, no, no. say is my subscriber who suggested i watch this who sent me the link first of all thank you they sent it within the community that we have links is in the description they requested me to watch this this is insane so thank you what a video why can't they talk about it why can't they say anything what is going on this guy refused no 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 i see the camera right there he doesn't want to say or talk about anything this guy who's doing his nails refused what did he see? You know anything about the Bohemian Grove? Yeah, I used to work there like 10, 15 years ago. Oh, I don't want to be on camera. Oh, oh no, my so days. What was that? I, never mind. Everyone here knew something about the Grove until they <laughs> saw my little camera. It's probably not a good place to be going unless you know what you're doing. What do you mean? Um, there's a lot of rich, uh, crazy people up there. You try to get in? I, my father was in. Oh, he was in the oh. club? Yeah. Who was he? He was a mason. Oh, he was a mason? 39th. Did you inherit his will? His mm. Freemason will? I can't, I can't disclose that. Okay. Is there anything oh my we should know? Mm, probably not. Probably, probably, you, you don't want to mess with it? Okay. No, I'm done here. All right, all right. Everybody's... Appreciate you. So everybody's afraid. Happen. Everybody's scared. Is there anything I should know? My father was a mason. All of this stuff. By the way, the Masonic Lodge, evil, if you don't know anything about it, is, is generally, generally evil. As, as you saw from the beginning of the video, what was said, everybody is... What a video, man. Now I'm intrigued. Now I am intrigued. What an amazing video. Probably not, probably, probably, you, you want to mess with it? Okay. I hope he breaks no, in. Done here. All right. So we can see Thanks a bit more time. than Alex Jones Appreciate showed you. us. What would happen? I don't know. Anything about the Bohemian Grove? No, lots about the Bohemian Grove. Would you like to share? Okay. No. Is it, uh, oh my is there some days! To it? Don't film me. Hit the road. Okay. Yeah, you can't really get up there though. You can't get in. You seen any crazy things or no? <sighs> Sometimes. Yeah. I think a lot of naughty naughty goes up there. You know. They just she's not. She's being filmed. Free and let loose. But luckily, I found a nearby crystal store with a lady who claimed to have folded George Bush's underwear when they came to town. Anything about what the Bohemian the? Grove? Too much. Too much? What do you know? I have actually folded laundry for the Bohemian Grove before when I needed to. So all of their laundry is processed through the laundry mat oh, interesting. that is around the corner. So I have folded George Bush's sheets for heaven's sakes. Uh, you will start to see a lot of helicopters flying in directly to the property. 
Um, Bill Clinton's been there, George Bush has been there. It has been rumored that the next president has always decided there before it occurs, but that is a rumor. I have literally had Grovers, some dude forgot his credit card and handed me his Grove card as collateral. Oh, and I'm whoa. like, Bro Grove ID. And before the Grove happens, you watch a bunch of limos with high end hookers come in. They're not allowed what? to bring women back to the facility, but the boys will stay off campus there. The other things that happen is they hit up all of the locals on where they can get drugs every effing year. There was a what? gentleman that I was blessed to serve at Main Street bar for about six years he actually lived on the grove year-round you have to be exceptionally rich you have to be like vetted in through family and I believe he spent his dying years there he was actually one of the really nice dudes he would come into Main Street three times a week for dinner and drinks um, it matters not what you have in life it is how you treat others so he was one of those that treated the janitor and the CEO with the same dignity and respect but not all grovers are the same <laughs> This is Alex Jones. Well, this is real, by the way. Wealthy and famous men are invited, combined with the extreme secrecy and security. This is the only real footage captured inside the event by Alex Jones in the year 2000. There we go. Some believe a real human was being burned alive during the ceremony, and others believe these guys were just hammered, goofing around, letting loose, and talking business. And that there's nothing demonic or satanic going on here. You think they're all fornicating with one another? Would not surprise me. Yeah. <laughs> Where all the big wigs hang out. Okay. That's where they party. What big wigs are we talking? Everybody. White House people. <laughs> You've been invited? Uh, no. Would you go if you were? I have go. Oh, yeah, I would. See, last time, uh, was, Whoa, uh, Granny. Running for president. Granddad. Al Gore. Okay. He, uh, he came through with his, his crowd, you know, black SUVs and all that stuff. And, uh, wow. He him in for a cocktail, but he refused that one. <laughs> but they were on their way to the Grove at the time. Do you think you all fornicate with one another? Oh, I know they do. You have proof? No. <laughs> they have some rituals and stuff, and you have to, like, pay a large fee to be part of them. All the weird stuff I think happens yeah, out the of the deep voice. I really don't know, except for just hearing stories. But who knows? Who knows what goes on out there, man? I don't. I'd rather not know. <laughs> do you think they're engaging in any wizardry or druid craft? I, I do. I, I believe that there's some ma something magical, out, or, you know, spiritual or something out there. But uh, the Bohemian, man, it's just uh, it's, uh, a bunch of mystery. That's what I think. I know some powerful men in the, you know, in this world, world leaders, they go there. I know that much. Have you seen anything interesting about Crazy. the Grove since you've been here? Wow, there, uh, you know, there's been a lot of political protests and that sort of thing. But I, I don't really uh, know much about that. Are you sure? Yeah. <laughs> That's now, a lie. Everyone feels too comfortable with the idea of a group of elites meeting in the secrecy of the woods to decide the fate of the rest of the country. The workers mm. at Bohemian Grove are suing the elite club for wage theft. In fact, one worker described members as obscenely wealthy with private jets, multi-million dollar cars, $200,000 watches, homes on the beach in Malibu. They said that they would have to perform tasks that were beyond their job duties, including such as one instance where a billionaire member forgot to bring underwear to the camp and the valets were asked to hand wash it. I remember when I was a child, my what? mom used to protest. Really? Yeah. What was she protesting, them coming here? Uh, white men of privilege uh, living exclusive lifestyles. Okay. Not sharing the wealth. As I walked into a bookstore where the owner assured me he mm. handpicked every book, something about this town fell I did not off. eat children. Like, you can't go to Bohemian. Sure. It's at the Bohemian Club. Oh, I see, okay. Yeah. Like, there's security and fences. And, and yeah. they don't stay here. No, they stay there. It's super interesting. I mean, and you can find a lot of stuff online. There's not a lot of published stuff about it because they're really secret. But we've tried to go onto the grounds and they've told us to leave. Ooh, you think we tried again? We'd get in? I try, try. Yeah? Yeah, try. Hey there. Y'all know anything about the Bohemian Grove? You can't go there. Can't go this there? This world that we okay, live in. you ever see them come through here? No, not really. No? No, these guys are pretty secretive. All right. You try to get in there and get caught, bye-bye. I'm dead? <laughs> it's very possible. They got security left and right there. All right, well, pray for me. See ya. You think they'll let me in? Nope. Won't even get through the front gate, my friend. Not even a parking lot. They're that strict. So I headed down towards the nearby river to scout out <sighs> a potential entryway via water. Bohemian Grove is all the way over those trees. The current looks fast. We're looking to find an owl out here. Um, I do know if you go down that road and take a left, if you keep going, there's like a barricade. 
It's like a weird fence. It almost looks like a bunch of metal wrapped around it and everything. Really weird. Creepy? Kind of creepy. Almost like a Resident Evil kind of vibe. Ooh. You know anything I should know about it? This video is nah, crazy. Not really, other than it's highly sec like security is always on patrol with them. Oh, we get. You know what's crazy about this video is is the level of detail that he's put into this because when Alex Jones did this, he just snuck in, you know, gave us a, a bit of, you know, and then back then the footages weren't as clear as today. We didn't have ultra ultra HD 4K cameras and all of this. So I'm glad it's being done like in HD and uh, hopefully we, we're able to see just yeah what exactly goes on in them man because this is crazy stuff control with them oh, we get people coming in for bohemian and everything and you can just tell about the cars and all that stuff so lamborghinis or like suvs a little bit of both if you were to see a grove member would you be able to recognize one sometimes like in the summer when they're there because they have like certain like uh, they they what is it that all white uh, thing sometimes they wear like all white garb yeah yeah, yeah but not, not always that's a the heck? I know there's a bunch of hookers that fucking stay over here while they're here. Are they hot? Uh, yeah, I mean, yeah, but they charge way too much. Oh, you've asked their price? Uh, no. How do you I'm know that, sir? I'm just, uh, I'm <laughs> thinking the day worth the bullshit to begin with. Nah, so, yeah, you know, like, you know. <laughs> I don't think so. half of them know what they're doing around with, really. <laughs> okay. But I mean, you know. Mine looks like an ancient Sumerian god. I'm sure you've seen this shit. You saw an owl driving in here too on that little lodge. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm doing with. I mean, it's somehow related to it. But there's a lot of owls around here too. <laughs> what is Moloch? What's like the simplified version of? As far as I know, Moloch was uh, some sort of uh, Semitic god. I know they sacrificed uh, children, children to him and stuff. The only one that we know about the, the big ritual there is they have that big owl statue, and they burn a child in effigy for the what is it? The cremation of care. Yeah, yeah. I think they're burning kids out there? I think they have, possibly in the past. Well, I've been back there before. Wow. Oh, really? Yeah, it worked for. It's true, and it's not, I've never been there. Just take a left and keep going, then when they stop you, then they will, you went in the building. Yeah. After learning as much as I could from the locals and waiting until the cover of the night, it was now time to see if I could infiltrate the grove using an inflatable kayak I bought off Amazon, avoid security, and make my way to the 40 foot tall owl statue undetected. Respect the editing, man. The editing's crazy. It's night time. Let's go. Alright, it is 12 12. Let's see if she loads. 12 12 gateway. Catherine. We think it fell all the way up. It's like sinking immediately. Okay, I'll give it a shot. The only problem was the moment I got in this kayak. I don't know if float, dude. It filled up halfway with river water, soaking me entirely, and the current was so fast I was getting pulled downstream and had no chance of paddling up shore where I needed to go. I'm sinking. I'm getting swept out. I'm fucked. I'm fucked. <laughs> the current's too strong on the other side. I'm just walking up. No, dude, I'm cooked. Did you make it across? No, dude. I'm getting sucked in. I'm fighting for surviving right now, dude. I don't know where this leads. Got a branch. The editing is crazy. crazy. I'm alive. Just get out, dude. The current is fucking ridiculous. I'm halfway soaked in water right now. I'm definitely gonna get hypothermia. I mean, the closest like exit exit point it's got this is crazy. Woods, essentially, yeah, I'm branches are breaking. Something that looks climbable. Mm. I'm gonna try to get out. Subscriber man, thank you for requesting subs requesting this. <laughs> Hey, or suggesting so I mean, say. Sure. I'm just trying to climb up the hill and get out of here. Kayak is gone. I'm fighting for survival. After yanking myself out of the river and crawling my way through someone's backyard, I barely made it back to land. My kayak was swallowed by the river, and I had to think of another way to get in the grove before sunrise. We need to re-strategize the game plan right now because I don't see any feasible way. I'm going against the current all the way across there. I don't think it's possible. I thought mm. I was gonna end up in Russia at the end of this river. I'm scared. Let's go. We need to re strategize. 30 minutes I to stretch that. through the Russian River via kayak, so now we're just gonna bull rush straight through the mountains, jump over any fences if I see them, and hopefully not get caught. It's 2 a.m. We're running out of time before the sun rises. It's time to get this done. Cheers.
With five wow. hours until sunrise, the plan was now to hike up the woods right to the left of the main entrance, stealth hike around the security through the mountains until I made it to the owl. Wow. Uh, this is a curse. This is a curse backup plan. No, no, we've no. we've paved a random mountain road. I'm thinking this is probably the plan we it's should a lot of work to put in. You might be right. The kayak was a death sentence out there. I'm surprised I didn't die or drown. The water was cold. I was full of water. Blake is legit gonna drop me off. I'm gonna rush into the mountains mm -hmm. with no light, just straight up. Uh, for legal reasons, this is all generated by AI. I'm a little bit shell-shocked from that last experience and I am afraid of how this plays out. I do not want to go to jail. <sighs> that would suck. Here into the woods and go up the mountain. Crazy. You might be in someone's backyard. A light might turn on like a, you know, motion detecting light. This is insane. I can't believe literally. Until you're in the darkness. Right there. Right they there. went out and oh, done this crazy. after Alex Jones done, done, done it. As I'm crouch hiking in pure darkness for two hours straight, I make it to this point on the map, and on my life, I hear what sounds like human feet crunching leaves in front of me, and... <sighs> so, just to double check, I wait in silence for ten minutes. I hear nothing. I move ten steps to my right. I stop. I listen. I hear the same sound of footsteps crushing through the brush and what sounds like a person going... <sighs> Oh, hell no. At this point, I'm afraid for my life. So I run down the hill and decide to bum rush the main gate and see if I can sprint my way to the owl without getting caught by security. What? Oh, hell no. Oh! I gotta run. What the heck was that? Scared out of my mind, I ran as far as I could to Blake in the getaway car, and we sped back to our hotel to think of a final strategy to get into Bohemian Grove before sunrise. Let's go. <gasps> I met with the chihuahua and I guess I put your hands up. Actually? <laughs> two hours until sunrise, I drove back to the hotel, drank a Red Bull, Bruh. and decided I would have to try one last time. Right there. That's where you go. Okay, I'm going in. All right, brother. Pray for me. Pray for me indeed. This is insane. The, qu the quality though, I like it. it. Clear, you can see everything. 5 a.m. When I jumped the gate this time, the guards must have been asleep or taking a dump because no one saw me and I ran into the cover of the darkness towards the owl, making sure to turn my flashlight off to remain undetected. Just gotta hop the gate and get out. He's close, he's so close. This is crazy. All right, we made it in. Is this where all the people sit on Alex Jones' video? If that's the case, then the owl should be down there on his right. Isn't it crazy? Powerful, yeah. rich, smart men come there Talking to... So as I planked on the ground, waiting for it to drive past me, he whips the car to the left, shining the light straight onto me, and I oh. run. We gotta Crazy. Crazy. He just come on a little bit further, buddy. Get out of there. This is insane. If this doesn't scream weird, I don't know what does. Oof. Headache. Hey. Just give up. I'm, I'm sorry. Hi, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Thank you for sparing me. 
Goodbye. Sorry. Oh, I'm sorry. Wow. Drive. Drive. Holy shit. Woo. <laughs> Quite make it to the owl. I think I was on my ass. I made it to the cathedral thing. I saw him pull in. He went off road. I was like, but he's not messing around. So I sped out of there. And I made it out alive. Please don't sue me. We were just curious. I apologize. But you had to let us satisfy that curiosity. While I risked my life to get a mere glimpse into the secret world of the powerful elite, <laughs> I decide on how us peasants shall live. Just know that whatever happens, I would never kill myself. Also, whoever has the most viewed TikTok or YouTube short using oh, from days. this video, I'll send you $500. Post however many times you want, but you must tag my TikTok slash YouTube at and put YouTube Tyler Oliveira in the title slash description. Wow, guys. That was nerve-wracking, insane, and I just, I just generally, I, I'm speechless. I am speechless. I felt like I was watching a movie, but it felt more real because it's obviously it's reality. I really wanted them to get to the hour. I mean, so this shows you how much of a G Alex Jones is, to be honest with you, because he snuck in there and recorded the actual ritual and all of this. If only he had a 4K camera, we would have been able to see so much and break, you know, bring to light some some truths that these elites are doing. But what on earth would possess powerful elite people, clever, intelligent men, okay, with normal working brains to get together in a boys club, do human sacrifices, allegedly. These people are satanic. Let's be real. A lot of them are satanic, Masonic Lodge, they're Masons. As you heard from some of the locals saying, oh, damn, man, I wanted them to generally, generally sneak, uh, sneak in. But let's pray maybe one day another person does on one of the ceremonies and the world gets to see, man, because this is this is ridiculous what goes on. And this, this is a bigger reason for you to seek God and to have, have God as priority number one. If not, oh, you might just be in trouble. Okay, so seek God, seek first the kingdom of God and everything else and his righteousness, of course, and the rest will be handed over to you. If you are a Christian, take it serious. You need to have resources. You need to become financially independent. Why? There's slavery that's coming. Don't forget the revelations or the Bible is mentioning about receiving the mark of the beast forehead or on your hand when a man or woman won't be able to buy or sell without having the mark or the number of his name 666 and so forth and all of this stuff so you need to get resourceful you need to become wealthy so you you have do you get what i mean so you don't get decimated so that's exactly what we're working on school never taught snt find the link somewhere it's going to be somewhere it's the only link on this on this channel and join why because we're christians and we're trying to obtain success without losing our soul in the first place hardest thing to do on earth i promise you